Ah, the check engine light. Every car enthusiast's least favorite sight. It pops up on your dashboard, unannounced, like an uninvited guest at a dinner party. Suddenly, you're left wondering, what's wrong now? Don't worry, we've all been there. One minute you're cruising down the road enjoying the purr of your engine and the next, you're facing a cryptic warning light. One of the usual suspects behind this automotive riddle is the P0222 trouble code. This little code can cause a whole lot of driving headaches from sluggish acceleration to a complete engine stall. But fear not, fellow petrol heads, because today we're going to demystify P0222 and give you the know-how to tackle it head on. Just like a doctor diagnoses an illness, we need to understand what this code means before we can fix it. So buckle up, grab your toolkit, and let's get this sorted. In the world of cars, every code tells a story, and P0222 is no exception. This particular code signals a problem with your car's throttle position sensor, often shortened to TPS. Now the TPS is like the messenger between your accelerator pedal and the engine. It tells the engine how much air to let in based on how far you press the pedal. When you see P0222, it means the signal from the TPS is low input, or weaker than it should be. Basically, your car's brain, the ECU, isn't getting the right message about how much throttle you're applying. This can lead to all sorts of performance issues like hesitation, stumbling, or even a refusal to start. Understanding this code is the first step to fixing the problem. Now that we know what we're dealing with, let's locate the source of the issue the TPS itself. Think of your car's engine as a well-oiled machine with each part playing a vital role. The throttle position sensor, or TPS, is a small but mighty component in this intricate system. It's typically located on the throttle body, which is responsible for controlling the airflow into the engine. Picture this. The throttle body is like the gatekeeper of your engine, and the TPS is the watchful guard standing by. As you press the accelerator pedal, the throttle plate inside the throttle body opens, allowing more air into the engine. The TPS monitors this movement and sends a signal to the ECU. Finding the TPS is usually straightforward. It's a small sensor, often black or gray, with a connector attached to it. It's usually secured to the throttle body with a couple of screws. While the exact location can vary depending on your car model, a quick glance at your owner's manual or a search online should point you in the right direction. Now that we've found our culprit, it's time to roll up our sleeves and get down to business. There are a few common reasons why your TPS might be sending a low input signal. First things first, let's check the wiring. Over time, the wires connecting the TPS to the ECU can become damaged, corroded, or loose. Inspect the wiring harness carefully for any signs of wear and tear. A loose or damaged wire can disrupt the signal, causing the P0222 code to pop up. If you spot any issues, a bit of electrical tape or replacing the damaged section should do the trick. Next, let's examine the TPS itself. Like any hardworking component, it can wear out over time. A faulty TPS won't be able to accurately measure the throttle plate's position, leading to an incorrect signal. If the wiring looks okay, the TPS itself may need replacing. Luckily, it's a relatively inexpensive part, and a fairly easy job to tackle at home with a few basic tools.